It's the weekly reset as well as the new Iron Banner for Season 3 is available today. And I will go over everything that is available for this week. And we're going to start right now. What's up guys, Reckless here, welcome to Guardian Watcher. If you enjoy my content, then hit the subscribe button and click on the bell, that way you guys don't miss out on any future videos. So, given that it is the weekly reset, we will be going over the milestones first. As for the milestones, we have daily for is an Iron Banner, then we have to complete three Iron Banner challenges, then we have Leviathan, which you need to complete the Raid or Raid Lair, then we have the Nightfall, this week's Nightfall is... The Inverted Spire... Then we have Call to Arms, which you win glory by participating in Crucible matches. Clan XP, which you earn Clan XP in Strikes, Raids, Crucible, and World Activities. The Flashpoint this week is on IO. And if you do the Heroic versions of this, you can get it done a lot faster. And then we have uh, Heroic Strikes, which we need to complete three. Then we have Iron Banner Season 3. And we have to speak to Lord Saladin. So, let's go ahead and find out what Tess Everest has at the Eververse this week. Always good to see you. I'm gonna turn this in real quick. Okay, so for the emotes, we have collaborative dance. Then we have disco dance. For the speeders, we have Glam, uh, Tobagan, the ships, we have Dusk Harrier, as well as the Curious Glory, I can't even say that Roman numeral. As for an exotic, we have a ghost shell called the Skyline Flipside Shell. This is what it looks like. And it comes with two dedicated perks. One of them being Speed Demon, as well as Omni Telemetry. And the last one is actually going to be a random one once you actually get it. The armor of the week is the class items. This is what it is for the Warlock. Whoops. Thanks for shopping. What can I do for you, Guardian? As for the ornaments, we have the Dread from Below for the Telesto. As well as the Jade Jester for the Jade Rabbit. A wonderful Jade Rabbit that Kembo loves so much. Then we have... Purple Class Sigil for your Transmat effect, as well as Ghost Green. And for Shaders, we have the Omelon Meteor Gloss. And these shaders are not new at all. Then we have the Vest Poison Shimmer. Dawn and Dusk. and Indigo Matrix. Last but not least, we have your Gleaming Boon of the Vanguard, of the Crucible, and then your Fireteam Medallion. So we are going to check out Lord Saladin's new inventory for Season 3 of the Iron Banner. So let's actually go over what he has for gear. Now the armor here are all ornaments. So they go on the original Iron Banner gear. This is what it looks like for the Warlock. Then we have a sidearm. Here are the boots. We have a sniper rifle. Then 
this is the gauntlets. Then we also have a uh, submachine gun. This is the chest piece. And we have another hand cannon. This is the helmet. Actually, it looks pretty badass. Kind of uh, reminds you of uh, probably Shredder in a way. Then we have a rocket launcher. We also have an auto rifle. We have an emblem, and then we also have a Iron Banner ship, and this is what it looks like. Don't forget to visit Kate 6 in order to get these awesome treasure maps, and this month, or I'm sorry, this week should be on IO, so go ahead and grab those for 4800 Glimmer each. And if you enjoyed this video, then feel free to watch these videos as well. You never know, you just might like them. And if you do, leave a like, share them, and then come back for more, because you know you want to. Thank you guys for watching, and remember, less guns doesn't mean less crime. And I will see you guys next time.